Bitcoin, the digital gold. Bitcoin, like gold, is finite. There will only ever be 21 million Bitcoin. This hard cap is intentional. It mimics the scarcity of precious metals, giving Bitcoin value. Unlike fiat currencies, which can be printed endlessly, Bitcoin cannot be inflated away. This digital scarcity is a core principle of Bitcoin's design. This limited supply has significant implications for the future, especially for the process of Bitcoin mining. As we approach the 21 million limit, understanding the mechanics of mining and the role of transaction fees becomes crucial. Bitcoin mining is the lifeblood of the Bitcoin network. It is the process through which new Bitcoins are introduced into circulation. Specialized computers called miners solve complex mathematical problems. These problems are so intricate that they require significant computational power. Solving these problems secures the network and adds new transactions to the blockchain, Bitcoin's public ledger. This ledger is a transparent and immutable record of all Bitcoin transactions. Miners receive Bitcoin as a reward for their efforts. This reward incentivizes miners to continue securing the network. This reward, however, is not constant. It changes over time due to a process called halving. Every 210,000 blocks, roughly every four years, the reward halves. This mechanism ensures the controlled supply of Bitcoin. This event, known as the halving, is programmed into Bitcoin's code. It is a fundamental aspect of Bitcoin's monetary policy. The next halving is predicted to occur in April 2024, reducing the reward from 6.25 Bitcoin per block to 3.125 Bitcoin. This reduction impacts the profitability of mining. This steady reduction in block rewards leads us to a significant question. What happens when all 21 million Bitcoin are mined? The future of Bitcoin mining and its economic implications remain a topic of much debate and speculation. Once all 21 million Bitcoin are in circulation, miners will no longer receive block rewards. This fundamental shift will mark a new era for the Bitcoin network. Their income will solely depend on transaction fees, which are small payments made by users to incentivize miners. These fees are paid by users who want their transactions prioritized and added to the blockchain more quickly. The higher the fee, the faster the transaction is likely to be processed. The viability of this model, however, hinges on several factors. Bitcoin's continued adoption, which is crucial for maintaining a robust network. The volume of transactions on the network, ensuring there are enough transactions to generate sufficient fees and the dynamics of the fee market itself which can be unpredictable and volatile. If fees are too low, miners may lack the incentive to secure the network, potentially compromising its security. Conversely, if fees are too high, it could deter users and hinder Bitcoin's usability, making it less attractive as a digital currency. The transition to a fee-based system is not without its challenges. As the block rewards diminish over time, miners will increasingly rely on transaction fees to sustain their operations. Ensuring adequate security for the network will require a delicate balance. This balance is crucial to maintain the integrity and trustworthiness of the blockchain. Transaction fees must be high enough to incentivize miners while remaining low enough to avoid deterring users. Striking this balance is essential for the long-term viability of the network. Furthermore, alternative revenue streams for miners are being explored. These include innovative approaches such as integrating mining operations with renewable energy sources, demand response programs where miners temporarily cease operations to stabilize electrical grids, are gaining traction. These programs help in reducing the environmental impact of mining activities. Access to cheap and sustainable electricity also plays a crucial role in mining profitability. Utilizing renewable energy sources can significantly lower operational costs. The future of Bitcoin mining is uncertain, but the ingenuity of the community and the fundamental principles of the technology provide grounds for optimism. Continuous innovation and adaptation will be key to overcoming future challenges.